Hey y'all, appreciate y'all watching. Also appreciate everybody who subscribes and hits the like button. It helps a lot, it means a lot. I really appreciate that. I uh, just want to give y'all a little um, put together video of before and a now, our progress on the kitchen. Right here you can see, this is uh, before we started anything. This is, well I mean, it's cleaned out mostly. You gotta remember before it was piled up, you couldn't walk through it. You know, those ugly green cabinets. Uh, that painted on vent hood, the unpainted walls, and that we stripped the old floor up. Um, and so we're going to start by pulling off the cabinet doors. But you see Jeff pulling them off right here. And they had some ugly old brass hardware, and hardware is expensive. So we just chose to paint it. You can see we already painted the vent hood black and got rid of that where it was written on. And there was junk in those cabinets. Um, we cleaned all that out and bleached all the cabinets out so we don't feel gross putting dishes up there. And there's me just removing some hardware. And uh, like I said, hardware is expensive, so we decided to just um, paint these. I like the way they turned out, painting black over the old uh, antique gold look at it. It gave them a nice little shine. I'm not really moving that fast. I sped the video up right there. And there's where I was painting some hardware. This is just Jeff starting some of the painting. It's the end of the cabinet. He's, we still got to trim out. So, um, you know. And also, this is a paint and primer in one. So people are like, you didn't prime first. It's a primer paint combination. And that's the same blue. It's on the handle of uh, Cobalt Tools from Lowe's. We had them color match the handle. Um, you know, so there's that. And again, this is uh, sped up a little bit. You know, so he's not really painting that fast, but you know. You have to excuse our mess because we're living amongst all this while we're doing it. And so there is, you know, like I said, it, it's lived in. And it's hard to keep it clean while you're living in it and building in it. And this is the only room we've got close to done so far. Um, like I said, you know, as we get the money and the time, we do more. Um, we still got to buy trim. We still got to trim out, you know. I don't even know what he's saying right there. But we gotta get, you know, trim out around the ceiling and the floors. Man, even sped up, this is going longer than I thought. Y'all get to hear me just ramble while he's uh, doing that. But we use that same blue. Uh, we put Wayne's coating around the bottom half of the kitchen where there's not cabinets and we use that same blue. And that's that gray y'all have seen us do earlier if you've been following along. I thought I made this clip shorter. It's been a process, like I said, it's uh, it's been a process getting this done. And I'm, I'm finally glad we're at the point we are now because it doesn't feel Having one room almost done, one room that at least looks done, is making us feel a lot better about being in here. I mean, we're still walking on subfloor in the rest of the house, but at least we got a floor in the kitchen now, which you'll see in a few moments. No, he's just going back over that again. Um, he's actually cutting flooring there. And he's putting in flooring there. I must have left out, because you can see the wainscoting's already up. I must have left out the video, the clips of him painting the wainscoting 
and hanging the wainscoting. So I apologize for that. Yes, yeah, just him uh, putting down the floor and then hammering it tight into place. Yeah, I did. I'm sorry, guys. I left out the video, the clip of. Uh, I thought I edited it in. But anyway, I, it's not in there. And then here's just a view of the kitchen where we're at so far. You can see the wainscoting, see the flooring. Cabinets done. We painted that hood, hood vent. Took like the new blinds in here. That's it. That's where we're at so far. I know it's not great, but it's a huge difference.